Psalm 13, A Prayer for Help How much longer will you forget me, Lord, forever? How much longer will you hide yourself from me? How long must I endure trouble? How long will sorrow fill my heart day and night? How long will my enemies triumph over me? Look at me, O Lord, my God, and answer me. Restore my strength. Don't let me die. Don't let my enemies say, We have defeated him. Don't let them gloat over my downfall. I rely on your constant love. I will be glad because you will rescue me. I will sing to you, O Lord, because you have been good to me. Psalm 14 Human Wickedness Fools say to themselves, There is no God. They are all corrupt, and they have done terrible things. There is no one who does what is right. The Lord looks down from heaven at us humans to see if there are any who are wise, any who worship Him. But they have all gone wrong. They are all equally bad. Not one of them does what is right, not a single one. Don't they know? asks the Lord. Are all these evildoers ignorant? They lived by robbing my people, and they never pray to me. But then they will be terrified, for God is with those who obey Him. Evildoers frustrate the plans of the humble, but the Lord is their protection. How I pray that victory will come to Israel from Zion. How happy the people of Israel will be when the Lord makes them prosperous again. Psalm 15, What God Requires Lord, who may enter your temple, who may worship on Zion your sacred hill, those who obey God in everything and always do what is right, whose words are true and sincere and who do not slander others, they do no wrong to their friends nor spread rumors about their neighbors. They despise those whom God rejects, but honor those who obey the Lord. They always do what they promise, no matter how much it may cost. They make loans without charging interest and cannot be bribed to testify against the innocent. Whoever does these things will always be secure.